You are pushing your luck, little man. Bread, three dollars extra. You come back one year. No soup for you. <laughs> you always want to hear me say it. Unless they say it, sometimes people will say it to me. But I think people are surprised because they go like, could you? And I'll just go, no soup for you. And they jump and they say, have to make you jump or else it's no fun. No soup for you. Come back one year. Uh, I would never be in the restaurant business. My father was in the restaurant business. So I became an actor instead. <laughs> and now, as an actor, I find myself back in the restaurant business. Better than any soup on the shelf in any grocery store. And the role on Seinfeld, it was just an audition. I was a big fan of the show, just like everybody else. I was just really surprised because when we worked on the show, I got the feeling that they didn't think that that was going to be one of their better episodes. But I didn't care because it was a job. I was just happy to, to have, you know, a week on Seinfeld. It was a really good gig back then. Out of all the Seinfeld episodes, this is my favorite episode of all time. To have him actually serve your soup, you know, that's like, that's like the bucket list, you know, right there. There's no other people like those characters on TV anymore. Kramer, Elaine, Jerry, the whole, and George, of course. I hardly even watch TV anymore. I just watch the Seinfeld reruns. Like, I had a group of 13-year-old guys come up to me and go, oh, you're the soup Nazi, it's awesome, we love Seinfeld. And I would just go like, so does it bother you? There are no cell phones, computers, hey, you know, any of your technology, there's none of that. And they go, yeah, man, it's like really retro. You know, God bless Seinfeld. He's, he's, he is, you know, taking Al's suits around the world that folks know about them all over. And we have the soup man here today, Larry, you know, bleeding out the soups in honor of, of working with us and, and getting the news about the soup out. The one thing that I enjoy about doing this for these guys, for this company, is that I know it's the best soup you're going to eat. With that in mind, you know, it's, it's just a pleasure to go anywhere with them and serve the soup to people and, you know, because I just know it's the best. And that, my friends, is good soup.